Welcome to No Silly Questions, the show where I, Mike Garibald, try to answer or find the answer to your Salesforce questions, no matter how hard or silly they are. And this week, the question comes from Penelope. So Penelope, let's hear your question. Hi, this is Penelope. I'm an awesome admin in North Carolina. And my silly question is about the default recently viewed. We all know this was true in Classic also. Every time you go to a tab in Salesforce, it defaults to recently viewed. And while Lightning did make an improvement by allowing us to pin default list views, the awesome admin can't control that. Why? Ooh, that's a really good question. List views, very important for admins. Now, I just so happen to have had a person on the podcast that loves to talk about list views and also loves board games. That's a hint. I don't know if you know the answer. But let me throw it over to product manager Ben Adala, who can answer your list view question, Penelope. So, Ben? Hey, my name is Vin. I'm one of the product managers on our UI platform team. Uh, Penelope, great questions. I'd like to take a moment to um, answer them as best as I can. So right now, admins can't uh, pin list view for users, uh, but this is great feedback. And I've definitely uh, taken a note of this to help prioritize based on you know, all the requests that we're getting. Uh, in the meanwhile, what I've seen um, you know, admins be able to do to push best practices uh, for their users is um, you know, through a feature called in-app guidance, which allows you to create prompts that remind your users of what the best practices are. So if there's a best practice that you have around um, you know, pin list that you want users to know, that's one great way of uh, informing them. Now, I do have some good news on your um, you know, qu request and question about um, filterability on related lists. So I'm not sure if you caught uh, Dreamforce this year, but uh, we announced that in summer 22, uh, we do plan to add um, filterability to related lists. Of course, uh, safe harbor here, it's a complicated feature, uh, but it's already something that we've put a, quite a bit of effort in and we want to um, try to finish it out and get it to uh, get it to the finish line. So hopefully the wait is not too long. Again, safe harbor. So uh, thank you for all those questions, uh, Penelope, and uh, I look forward to hearing from you and some more feedback um, as you get this message. Thank you. Thanks for that answer, Ben. That was awesome. And thank you, Penelope, for that question. Be sure to keep them coming. And hey, you know what? Maybe send us a question you'd love for our evangelist to answer because I'd love to throw some automation questions at Jennifer or maybe some demo questions at Leanne. What questions do you have for Jay? Maybe myself about the podcast. Be sure to tweet us at Salesforce Admins, no I on Twitter, or tweet me. I am at Mike Gareful on Twitter. So thank you for watching this episode of No Silly Questions. We'll see you in the cloud.